Hey Libra, we're going to see um, why all of this happened and maybe give you some, some answers on some questions that you still have. So, and keep in mind the energies can be vice versa. Um, okay, Libra. So Libra. Libra. You have the um, the two of wands. So I feel like someone kept you in the dark about a decision that they made. So maybe they had decided on something else, um, but they just kind of didn't tell you. So they kind of left you hanging. Um, Hmm. And you have the Three of Pentacles. Um, so, you know, this is going to sound kind of strange. But I feel like whenever this person was done with you, they just kind of left you hanging. Like they were done. They were finished. And so they just left. But you didn't know. Does that make any sense? I hope this is making sense, but that's kind of what I'm getting. Hmm. Okay. Um, Libra. So you have the, um, the emperor. Um, I feel like you're still, I feel like you still carry some type of emotional connection with this person. You know, you, you deeply, deeply care for this person. And I feel like it's just hard for you to move on. I feel like you're trying to move on. Okay. I feel like you're trying to move on. And once you get, get to where, you know, you feel like you're, you're feeling good, you feel better. It's like this person pops back up. They might just send you a text or, you know, oh, hey, how are you? And it's like, if they would just leave you alone, I feel that, that you would be, you know, you could just keep going. But it's like, maybe as soon as you move on, they they come back. And then you have the hermit. Yeah, as soon, I'm telling you, as soon as you move on, on they they pop back up and they they just toy with you i think they know that they have some type of connection they know you love them they know that you have this deep emotion for them and that's i feel like that's why they do it um okay libra libra So you have the Four of Pentacles reversed. Um, you know, I, I feel like this person, um, I feel like they're kind of possessive over you in a strange, weird way. Like, maybe they're not in your face with it, but you probably don't even realize this. But it's like, I think this person has some type of ownership over you in a weird way. And... It's like as soon as you pull away, as soon as you, you know, you maybe haven't talked for like a week or two, it's like, boom, here they come. Yeah, okay. First of all, there's the devil, like, hello, here he is, or she. Yeah, it's like, here they come, just, ugh. Okay. Um, all right, Libra, Libra. So you have the King of Swords in reversed. Um, you know, Libra, I feel like, and you have the Ten of Swords reversed at the bottom. But Libra, I feel like you've come to the realization that this person, um, you know, they could have had a hidden agenda this whole time, a liar, 
I think you're, you're seeing that this person was very deceptive. Um, just toying with your emotions, your mind. I feel like this person, for some reason, they get a kick out of doing this. And I think you've, um, I think you're really looking at everything that's happened. You know, it's like having an epiphany. It's like, you're just really staring it in the face and, and trying to make sense of everything, I guess. Um, but lesson learned, definitely. I think you're discovering also that you're seeing how cold-hearted this person was, maybe. How um, this person was definitely a burden. They put a lot. Um, we have the Ten of Wands and the Two of Swords. I feel like you're realizing all of the burdens that you carried for this person, you know. And they just, they left you stuck, left you hanging. <laughs> Look at this Queen of Wands, like... Please go away. I don't know who this person is. They're constantly, constantly in your energy, Libra. Yeah, this could be a female. She's obsessed. She just loves Libra. I think somebody wants to be you, Libra. But anyway. So anyway. So this person just left you hanging. They, um, you know, they, they left you to pick up your own pieces. And I feel like you... You just, you could not make any sense of it. Like, why? So, um, okay, Libra. Libra. So, you have the, um, the Knight of Swords. So, then you have the Eight of Swords at the bottom. So, Libra, it, listen, it, it's so... It's great that this person did this to you because I think you dodged a bullet. I think this person kept you trapped in your head, stressed, worried. You probably loved them so much that you worried about how they were doing, what they were going through, if they were okay. I think you put your, you put their needs before yours. So it, it's a good thing. I can't make this up. See this guy back there? He's kind of smirking. I'm telling you, this person. Oh. They, they, they knew that they were stabbing you straight in your heart. Keep in mind, more than once. And look at him. He enjoyed this. He, she, whatever. This person enjoyed it. That's what you need to look at. This person enjoyed this. They thought it was funny. Oh, my God. If this person ever tries to come back around to you, Libra. Oh, my God. This person is a manipulator. I can't make this up. I'm getting chill bumps. If this person tries to come back, I want you. I'm shaking. I want you to look at what they did to you. Okay. If you have old texts, pull them up. Look at them. Remember, don't allow this person back into your life, Libra. They lied to you. They stabbed you in the back. You need to get up and look at what they did to you. You don't want this person back. Trust your intuition. So if something ever like, you know, like this ever happens again, or you come across someone like this, the first time you, you feel a red flag or you feel, you know, like something's off, go with that. Go ahead and, and follow that so you can save yourself, you know, the heartache, I'm telling you. Um, okay, let's just get some advice. Libra. What is some advice for Libra? Libra. Oh my God, listen, you have this queen of wands in reversed. This person is just a nightmare. Jesus. So your advice. You have the ace of cups reversed and the, um, the hangman reversed. Your advice is to get the hell up. Do not let this person keep you stuck. They have nothing to offer you. They don't love you. 
they there's a there's even a little snake right there. Your advice. Look at this. It looks like a chair just full of snakes. I mean, it's roots, but this person, your advice is to to go leave. Like if this person, if you if this person is still in your life, leave. Stand up to this person. I'm telling you. See, I feel like this person's going to come in offering you a cup, whatever it is that they're trying to offer you. You need to stand up to this person and leave. Cut yourself free from this person. And if you have, keep going. Do not. The past is in the past for a reason. Oh, my God. Here's your advice. Get up and leave. Because here they are again. I'm telling you. If you're in a relationship with someone now, or you were, and, and this is what is going on, or this has happened, don't allow this person back into your life ever again. So, yeah, see, I mean, you've healed yourself from this because this is where they want you. They want you like this. So just get up and leave and don't ever look back. That's my advice, so. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope it gave you some type of insight or some answers, and I will see you in the next one.